Hello boys and boys, welcome, uh, it's Talik here. Today we're going to uh, check out some Kickstarter stuff. I don't use Kickstarter a whole lot, I don't explore it a whole lot, but I know there's some goofy stuff on there every once in a while when I do see something that comes along from somebody else. Uh, so I figured let, let's have a little bit of fun, let's explore some Kickstarters and see if we can find some absolutely terrible stuff. Um, or maybe some good stuff. Uh, we'll go a little bit into the games, obviously, as that's our kind of thing, and see what we got here. Um, I kind of want to also look at like some kitchen gadgets and stuff like that. Maybe we'll make that a separate video, because I do love me some kitchen gadgets. Uh, so I think we got like fresh favorites, taking off, home stretch, RPGs, PC games. Here we go, give me PC games. Discover more. Explore 17 projects, live PC projects in, in games on Earth, sorted by magic. Okay, um, we have Get Out, uh, first person, third person, puzzles, physics, spray painting, and day-night cycle. I'm sorry, what? 13 backers, 687 dollars, 100 percent funded. Get Out is gonna be, in parentheses, a single player action game focus, with focus on environment and puzzles. The first map is almost done. With some cool features like day night cycle, basketball, spray painting, puzzles, and a lot of physics. Mainly in first person, but also ability to change the third. Goal is to have a full story adventure mode with different maps to bring you smoothly for a game like a movie. This is really interesting. You can <laughs> chill, explore the map, play basketball, or spray cool graffiti. I don't quite understand. We got some screenshots here that look like that look make it look like a spooky game. Get out also sounds like a spooky thing, maybe just because of the movie. And there's a storyline. Mysterious places, various stor stories and rumors. It has spray painting and basketball, and you can chill. And what? So you're hold on here. You jump into the role of, the, of, of Jacob, a young man who lives his life in his only four walls. Uh, he's he's gonna see you some mysterious places. On a Sunday, his mother calls him and tells him that she would like to see him again. Uh, has a five-day trip with his old SUV. Plans to stop at a few interesting places. Says he'll be there in six days at the least. Latest. Plans to spend his first night in a hotel far away, far in the country. <laughs> Heard the craziest things. He has also hidden the guest uh, parked cars or luggage overnight. Another visitor since... What? I don't get it. So there's puzzles... And some like hidden stuff and a story. There's spray painting and basketball and physics. I am so confused. They don't have a video or anything, it doesn't seem. Which would be amazing. But I'm really confused by that. <laughs> but it's funded, apparently. It must only a $541 goal. So there's Get Out. You can check it out. <laughs> Kickstarter. Um, you can chill, do some puzzles, spray painting, basketball, day night cycle. Oh my goodness. Battle of the Worlds. Uh, okay. Shooter ball. What's shooter ball? Four backers, 10 days to go. Only $16 pledged. 1,210. This seems ultimately like just because of the name shooter ball. I feel like the other had more going for it, uh, and they want more money. Create a mar multiplayer physics sports video game in the first person where passing and ball possession are essential, where stealing the a ball is challenging, or defending the a player without the ball is necessary, just like in soccer, football, and basketball. Uh, okay. Local multiplayer for the game is finished, but we need money to finish the online multiplayer. Sadly, we just run out of money. Ranked competitive mode. Shot needs skill. How do the shots work in the basket game mode? The shots are skill based. You charge the power of your shot depending on your disc to the basket. This makes the shots feel very realistic and skill based. And of course, your aim is also important. There's attack, projectiles, ultimate, super speed. 
alphas are the guns in the game. Every alpha feels different. Was this like a basketball kind of thing? RGB exclusive skin. <laughs> it seems like it's a basketball type of thing. A first person basketball. Let, let's see what's here. Oh my god. So yeah, it just seems like basketball, to be honest. I don't know, it doesn't seem... It kind of reminds me of like Unreal Tournament. Uh, the like blitz ball mode thing they had. That's not what it's called, but I forget exactly. I'm, uh, yeah, not, not really all that impressed with the shooter ball. It seems like a good concept. I, I like things like Lucio Ball and obviously the Unreal Tournament one. I uh, don't know if that would take off. Not thinking it. 32 gigabyte NVIDIA Steam gaming machine and arcade DIY kits. Interesting. All out war, welcome to the front. All right, we got to look at it. We got to look at it. 25 missions spanning the globe. This looks like it was done in... I mean, I'm not the greatest Photoshop person, but let uh, this looks like it was done in paint. <laughs> 25 missions spanning the globe. Real world locations. Groundbreaking visual effects. For $4,528. There's $1 pledged by one backer with 14 days to go. Immersive sound. Intense combat experience. And ECB human-like enemies. I don't even know what that means. Result of over 25 years of related knowledge acquired from tel acquired from the television, film, animation, and software development industries. Okay. Um, you know what? You don't have a whole lot here. Just give us give us the video. Give us the video. And probably turn this down. Alpha gameplay footage. See? This I like. Simple. To the point. It seems like it's just the helicopter hovering. They got a long video. There is so much shooting going on. Somewhere else. <laughs> it's like nothing going on. So is it a... Chopper game then? Skip us. Looks like it's the chopper game. Groundbreaking visual effects. Those tanks are flying so high in the air. What is going on? What? <laughs> Why were they flying so high? Hold on. <laughs> Can we see that again? <laughs> they blow up and fly like almost as high as the chopper. And then that third one. <laughs> just like delayed and goes flying. Hold on. <laughs> what? This is ridiculous. Former contractor for Northrop Grum Grumman. McDonald, Douglas, Microsoft, Disney Interactives, and Disney Film, feature film and television. All skills have been necessary to develop a triple A video game that will exceed all expectations. I mean, I get that it's pretty alpha and everything like that, but... I don't know. Uh, it just seems like a generic helicopter game. To me. Okay. That's, that's, um... It gave us a whole bunch of different games all of a sudden. Uh, yeah, that that was that was that game. Um, <laughs> Seeds of friendship, a wonderful, joyful farming life sim. All right, come on, win us. Two hundred seventy-six dollars pledged of the ten thousand dollar goal. Twenty-three backers, eleven days to go. 
actually looks like it's got some art it's got this cool chicken thing all right i'm i'm already more impressed farming and life sim taking inspiration from the sixth generation console game harvest moon a wonderful life and the hidden gem Ch Ch chulip Build your dream farm, farm, restore an animal sanctuary, make new friends, and more. That's cute, too. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Plant harvest crops. Got a little cute, cute little, little, little animals. Fishing, foraging, bug collecting, build, barn, build and raise animals. You got cute cows. Do what makes you happy. You got a rainbow frog thing? Uh, I, I this already looks kind of cool. Befriend other characters. You can give them gifts and everything. So it looks like a it, very much a Harvest Moon or uh, My Time at Porsche. Any any of those kind of games, which are always good and always new ones, are are, are welcome. Day and night cycle routines seasons. We got a sleeping panda. Panda. Store an animal sanctuary. Oh, you can customize your character. Oh my goodness. Yeah, 10 out of 10 already. You got their own original soundtrack. Swimming and underwater foraging. Children who can grow and work on the farm. Additional player model, models. Dungeons, expedition, co-op. Look at that. Yeah, th they put some time into this one. They put some time into this one. Seeds of Friendship. Show us the deeds. Let's go. Is this their, like, soundtrack? Because this is awesome. <laughs> Character customization looks pretty sweet. Gather resources. Hit that rock. Let's go. <laughs> I think this is the standout winner of every out of everyone we've seen so far. This is like way more impressive. got a baller soundtrack look at the cute cows oh yeah you can ride a horse maybe you can make a horse character and ride on a horse oh yeah 10 out of 10 seeds of friendship steam early access kickstarter there you go that's that's a w 26 or 276 dollars out of 10,000 stellaris infinite legacy board game alien ai crimson company Oh, here, here's our ones. Load more. Immortal Gates of Pyre. Free to play strategy game. $109,000 pledged. For a free to play game, $109,000 pledged. Of a $31,000 goal, 1,257 backers with 26 days to go. What is this? Hunger, huge hunger and anti anticipation for a game like Immortal. Uh, what is it? Tell us what it is. Free to play strategy game. Okay, okay. Uh, large Germany's clash across three worlds, control of ancient relics and powerful magics. Lead your nation of choice as an immortal godlike commander. Okay, it's an RTS. I got you. Um, a whole bunch of goals. Yes, build bases. I don't, uh, you know what? Let's just look at the video. They had a video. Show us, show us the vid. Why is everything so loud? <laughs> is this... This is a story video. You know what? What do you got here? Internal pre-alpha. Looks pretty slick.
free to play RTS too. It's smooth controls, spell casting, commanders known as immortals. Not bad, not bad. I'm a fan of RTSs, but I'm not very good at it. Okay. Not bad. There you go. There's definitely a reason why uh, it got $109,000. All right. Well, there's our, our quick look at PC projects. I appreciate you guys watching. Let me know uh, if you guys like the Kickstarter reviews. We'll keep this one short and sweet. And maybe I'll look at some kitchen gadgets or something. Appreciate you guys watching. Toodles. Wow.